Okay, guys, I found the bathhouse. I also gave Geralt a haircut. He now looks more like a imperial, sort of black one, style-esque, if you know what I mean. Got a minute? I do. What do you want? Wiley, Horson Jr. He's working with Radovid. Huh? If this is reliable information, Horson's neck deep in shit. Source seems reliable. Hmm. It would certainly explain how he had the nerve to break with the Big Four. Need someone who can get me in to see Junior. You must still have some contacts among the Redanians? I don't, but you do. Enlighten me. Temerian, former commander of the Blue Stripes. Ring a bell? Vernon Roach. He's holed up with his men in a camp near Oxenford. Pay him a visit. You're sure to cheer him up at least. <laughs> Off to speak to Roach. Garrow just looks a bit more professional now. <laughs> Ladies. What is it, great boy? Looking for adventure? Uh huh. You look behind you, there's a horse emerging from the shadows. Rain again. Damn. Another point of interest uh, I bought a new saddle, which has got my up to from like, what was it, 91 before or some bollocks, and now it's. Yeah, this one gives me 70 maximum, uh, thing. Hey Which is always helpful. Anyway, we are off to Roxford, or whatever the hell it is. The very presence is in front of the eternal fire. Probably leading me towards the casino, is it? Because it seems to think that that's the most important thing ever. I'm gonna go fucking kill those dogs, whoever the hell is making them bark out there so fucking much. Alright, I'll tell you what, I'll go kill the fucking dogs and skin them alive. And uh, we'll skip ahead to Oxford, a thingamajig, when we reach there. Yeah, yeah, okay, okay, I'm gonna go kill the dogs, be right back. Alright, guys, well, we've got more ice kicking to do on our way. Another one. Run along home with the rest. Sir, show some mercy. We've not got nowhere to go. For us, it's Novigrad or death. Had enough for you lot. Sod off, or I'll have you skewered. They seem desperate. Let them through. Can't see any harm in it. Fucking hell. How many times have I got to repeat this? I've orders to turn back anyone who don't show a pass. Let these people pass. Yes, sir. <laughs> Thank you. We've got nowhere to go back to. Novigrad, that's a chance of a new life. Stay off the roads. Liable to run into another patrol. Shan't be taken like that again. We would be as careful as hares in a field bared by winter. But you, you was cast in a different mold than us. More like the hero that lies in the tomb near Crookback Hills. Tomb's in a cave in a hillside. Down Warren's at the foot of the hill. Folks say treasure inside's a sight to behold. Huge hoard. Might find something that suits you. Good luck. You'd be so pale if you ate onions and all. Move it! Alright, paid with information, I'm cool with that. What the book? You mean to patch your hen out? My granddad once returned from his travels with a book, fetched enough to buy him a home. Stop chattering and help me search. What are you guys up to? You know what they say about you, lot? The second sword. If you see the first one, I am a bricks. witcher. Smart. Greetings. What is it? Hmm? 
Don't mind him. Sit with us. You're most welcome to. Though be warned, we're in the middle of some serious studying, as our learned companion calls it. Thanks. Be happy to join you. What do they call you? I'm Geralt of Rivia. I'm a witcher. They call me Rufus, and this here learned fellow is Theophile Maria Roscoe, and, and this is... Uh... Sorry. Manfred. I'm Manfred. Uh, exactly. Uh, Geralt. Heard that name before. You frequent the fairs? Nope. You've confused him with Gerard, the stage artist who indeed attends fairs and breaks wind to the tune of popular melodies. To the delight <laughs> of the crowds, I'd add, our guest is none other than the White Wolf himself. Well, my apologies. Aren't you the one that... You know, the, the room was about Foltest's death. No, wasn't me. Hmm. Any news of the war, for instance? They say the Black Ones will mount a new offensive soon to cross the Pontar. I bet diamonds to peanuts Radovid won't manage to repel this time. Such a shame Henselt perished in Lormark. Blasted Dragon Slayer! Right you are. With Henselt alive, Nilfgaard wouldn't have had it so easy in the East. The Emperor's sure to take Novigrad soon. He'll seize the Temple Vault, the City Armada, the West will be all but his as well. You know a lot for an ordinary merchant. I do. What of it, hmm? Just that it makes me like you even less. First you ask about the message I'm carrying. Now you say you're waiting for Nilfgaard to cross the Pontar. You better come with me. I know some people who'd want to talk to you. You'll have to kill me first. If needs must. Relax. A misunderstanding. That's all this is. Hold him, Witcher. I'll find a rope. Ha! Not a chance! Sorry. Not about to get involved. I'll fucking manage on my own! Truth is, we're already the black ones. Economic. Stay in formation! Oh! One Nilfgaardian mole less. Can't actually know he was a spy. Oh, he was, he was. I know him on sight. See my share. On your way now, you're no use to us. Fucking neutrality. Fatherland needs to be defended. Not my fatherland. Death on three pounds of steel. Oh, I didn't have any documents on him for an alleged spy. Quest. Just little mini quests galore all over the place around it. What are you guys up to? Shenanigans, I assume, as always. It is always shenanigans. What's all this? Not your concern, that's what. Not an expert or anything, but you two look like you could use some help. Aye, it's true, we could. Barn's full up with some manner of beast. Bar them inside, but that won't hold long. And we'll be in a world of woe once they're loose. We're not rich, but cut the filth down, and we will pay you. Sure. Fine, I'll try to help you. We'll let you in the barn, then open the doors once it's over. Quick, Master Witcher, or they'll get out! It 
It's done. Open the door. Job's done. True enough. Here's your pay. And thanks for your help. Farewell. Twenty gold. Barely worth it. <laughs> barely yeah. worth the steel. I imagine if I'd left it, they would have broken out and I'd come back and they'll be dead. Take it he's in that cave, is he? Yeah, Temerian Patriots hide out. Looking for Roach. No one here by that name. Anything else? I see. And behind you, that's a berry picker's camp? We're, uh, bird watchers. Let me guess. That sword's in case you run into a hornbill. No. Hornbills aren't endemic to this area. Don't migrate here either. You blind, Hortensio! That's Geralt, old friend of mine. Come in, Geralt. Geralt of Rivia, safe and sound. Vernon Roach, Tamaria's last hope. Laugh all you want. Tamaria will rise again. Roach! I cannot abandon them. I... You can and must, because those are your orders. They'll die, please. We're done. Dismissed. What do you do here? Hunt Scoyatel? You jest, right? Who cares about the Scoyatel anymore? Temerian. That's what matters. How do you wind up here? Came with the army, of course. Its remnants. When Nilfgaard crossed the Yoruga, I dropped everything. Threw it all away to hell and rode for the front to fight the invader. Joined the Second Temerian Army under John Natalis. We were to stop the Black One's advance along the dull Blathana Mount Carbon line. And we did. For three days. Then they smashed us into splinters. Soon after, I heard Radovid was assembling his forces near Novigrad. That he'd promised to fight for a free north. Broke through with the remains of Natalis's army, but... But? But Radovid proved no better than Amir. So I decided I would mount my own fight. Looking for Horson Jr. I've heard of him. Though I'm not sure why you think he might be in my camp. Heard some birds chirping. You've got some of the same friends. Both seem to count Radovid among your allies. These birds. They're terribly talkative. I'll need to see them. You'll have to point them out. Mm-hmm. Meantime, Vernon, 
Willing to help, or do I need to keep looking? Hmm. As always, you've more luck than you deserve. I'm on my way to meet my Redanian contact. We're meeting near Oxenfurt, at a chess club. Thanks. Knew I could count on you. Beware of the other side of the river. One false move, and you could be royally fucked. Swords back, heave high. Where the black one's heads will fly. Swords down, heave out. You've got blood of stream and spout. We'll pay for the free Tamaria with our blood. Damn the blackens. Now, witches, they can't catch the pox. Isn't that right? It's true you kill kings. You and our commander. You trouble me, Greylocks. This is all over. I aim to open a whorehouse in Vizima, a proper one, with shaggy rugs on the walls and foul-smelling candles in it. Now, witches, they can't catch the pox, isn't that right? We're at the other side of the river. One false move, and you could be royally fucked. Nice little setup they have here. Yeah? Ooh! A witcher. Just what our band of merry men need. It's true you kill kings. You and our commander. Well, I'm not sure where that girl's bugging off to, but. I'm pretty sure we knew her from Witcher 2. It has been like ages. <laughs> Faster. All right, where are you leading me, game? In the wrong fucking direction, I'm, I'm to assume. Yes. Why is it like making the play cards with the casino guests as the main objective? It's really very annoying. Interesting basilisk you've got there. Course it's interesting. Won't see a beast like this anywhere near here. They spawn only in the wild wastes of Zeracania, from eggs laid by cockerels. Cockerel eggs, you say? Yeah, and what cocks they are. Lift their rumps like brood ends to other cocks. Eggs laid by such a cockerel must be brought to hatching by 101 venomous vipers. Then, the young basilisk pecks its way out. Huh, that's a wyvern, not a basilisk. <laughs> this basilisk is interesting, because it looks exactly like a wyvern. Young one, and he'll fed at that. You talk nonsense, sir. This is the most truest of basilisks. Right, what do I know? I'm just a witcher. All done now. If that's no basilisk, but some weavern, what did I pay for? Give me back my coin cheat. Brave soldiers, don't push, or it'll whoa, watch out! Best live up now! Sword Garold! Redania. 
Romania. You'll choke to death on Long three limits. pounds of steel. The cage was as fake as the basilisk. We like puking after that swill in the canteen. Did the alleged beach table leg it or something? Yeah, the beach table must have just legged it. My contact should be there. Ready? My contact awaits at the chess club. Let's get this over with. Come on. Witches, good folk, are like necrophages. Vile in appearance and reeking of dead men's bile. It's rotten. Something's not right. As always. <laughs> Let's see what. Checkmate. They say it's the game of kings. That chess teaches one to think strategically. What a load of rubbish. Both sides have identical pieces. The rules stay invariably the same. How does this mirror real life? Witcher. Do you know why I play chess? Boredom. <laughs> time killer. To kill time? I have no time to squander. Let alone kill. I play chess to reveal the game's secret. Blood thumps inside these chessmen. You need only listen, and you will hear. Dub dub. Dub dub. Dub dub. A heart pumping with life. Mm. I take a pawn, and I hear flesh being rent. I win a piece, and I hear screams from the depths of its bowels. I want to break the chessmen open. Squeeze the truth from them. Do you see what I mean? <laughs> I think that you're a, a tad bit unhinged and probably due to the fact that you're worried that the Emperor's gonna kill you. No, I don't. <laughs> you do not because you are not a king. Pawns see only their comrades at their sides and their foes across the field. A king has a different view of the chessboard. His greatest foes surround him. His own chessmen might trap him. And that is check and death. You see, Witcher, chess is the art of sacrificing your own pieces. Now do you see? I'm kind of comparing this guy to Tywin, Emperor Walter's face, and uh, it just makes me kind of want to go back over to the Emperor's dudes. They, they might be strict, but they fucking bring order. Or Temeria, but Temeria has no royal bloodline that I know of anymore, so, you know. No, I don't. 
No, still don't get it. Unimportant. Let us speak. Why have you brought the Witcher here? I think he'd best explain. Expected a Redanian spy. Had no idea we'd be meeting a king. When you have an opportunity to emit intermediaries, I'd suggest you avail yourself of it. Uh-huh. I'm looking for Cyprian Wiley, Orson Jr. I know Redania supports him. Why do you seek him? It's personal. Fair enough. I'll not pry. I have placed Junior in a mansion in Oxenfurt. Very few know this. They'll not let you in unannounced. Thus, you must tell them you've come about the new whores. Junior constantly requests fresh women. I hear he doesn't treat them well. Surprise, surprise. I appreciate the gesture, Your Majesty. A king should be severe towards his foes, generous to his friends. Apart from which, I'll expect you to return the favor. And also, Junior has lost his purpose. The Big Four is no more. I shall contact you to collect in due course. Now go. And you, Roach. We must speak another time. I don't put much faith Rabbit in that guy. sinking ever deeper into madness as I see it. I know where to find Junior. Don't really care beyond that. Geralt, come to think of it, I too wanted to ask a favor. I have a terrible problem with Vess. Need someone to talk some sense into her. Come see me at the camp. I'll tell you more. Let me think about it. See you, Roach. Don't shit. Where the hell is he? It's in Novigrad. Oh yeah, it is just in there. So we'll do this first. Well, since I talk too much. Orson Jr.'s men visit you too. Collecting protection coin. I also don't like their armor. <laughs> Just, that as well. The perfectionist in me thinks that red and like, bright red shiny like, horrible armor is just like no. <laughs> it's hard to Whores only ever go in. Not once come out. What do you want? Where's Horson Jr.? Oh, this one's got bollocks, don't he? Junior ought to know someone's sniffing around. Here to talk about the new girls for Orson. Never seen you here before. You know him. Can't say that I do. Huh, your memory's shit, huh? I'm new here. Yeah? What happened to Norbert? Cleaver happened to him. Poor sod. Better than to die of consumption, remember? He looked a bit on the down slope. All right. But next time, remember to bring the tarts for Junior through the back by way of the old canal. Go through there. Thanks. I'll keep it in mind. <laughs> 